Hello everyone and welcome back. In our today's video we will discuss work performance data, work performance information and work performance reports in project management. Distinguishing these three could be challenging for professionals, especially the people who are trying to take their PMP exam. The first step in this sequence is the work performance data. Work performance data are the raw observations and measurements identified during the executing phase of a project. For example, you are the site engineer for a construction project. The data such as an activity's actual start date, actual end date, duration of an activity, number of change requests on that day, the weather, and all these information are the work performance data, which you present in the next step to the project manager and project management team for analysis. Through this analysis, the work performance data transforms to the work performance information. Once the raw data is collected from the site, it's measured against the baselines, against the predefined metrics of the project, which turns it to the project work performance information. This information is then represented in specific ways and methods, which are called the work performance report. Such reports could be dashboards, they could be updated project schedules, which are presented to the senior management in order for them to have a clear sight of the project. In addition, the work performance data is collected from the executing phase of a project. The data is upgraded to information in the monitoring and controlling phase of the project, which is then presented to the project sponsors and their senior management in terms of project reports, as we talked about. Thank you for watching this video. If you found the content informative, please don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. Thank you very much.